Okay, Invisalign video number one. My name is Julie, and I wanted to kind of chronicle my journey with Invisalign. I know that a lot of people, a lot of adults are starting to get Invisalign, and I watched a lot of YouTube videos on the process um, before I made my decision to go ahead and take the plunge. So, um, the just some orthodontic background on me. I'll start with that. Um, I was told when I was a teenager that I had a crossbite and that I needed braces. However, my teeth were straight, at least at that time, and they looked okay. So because I was already in ninth grade and a lot of my friends, most of my friends had gotten braces, you know, more like sixth or seventh and were done with them by ninth grade, I guess due to just vanity and the normal self-consciousness of being a teenager in the ninth grade, I opted against getting braces and even though my parents were willing to, um, you know, pay for all that and do all that for me. So basically I have a pretty severe crossbite. However, um, over time, my bottom teeth has started to get crooked. You can see this one in particular right here is really jutting out and this one is moved back so here's the problem that has been apparent for several years now I should probably go ahead and, and admit that I have not been to the dentist or to the doctor since before COVID so three years probably more because I don't think I went to the dentist in January of 2020 or anything like that. So it's been probably more like three and a half years since I've been to the dentist or to a doctor. But I don't take any prescription medication, so that's part of the reason, I suppose. Okay, so the this tooth right here on the top has a pretty bad chip in it that happened when I was 18 years old and it was repaired the repair fell off in about 2011 i want to say and i had it redone the repair um sometimes like especially when i'm exercising and doing cardio the tooth bothers me it's like with that increased blood flow with cardio the tooth starts to tingle I don't know what that means. I told the dentist about it and he didn't think it was a big deal. Then I had some pain in the tooth. I would call it more than tingling, which I told him about. And he said, I don't think that, and I asked him if he thought we should redo the, the repair on the chip. He said, I don't think there's anything wrong with the repair. He said, I think that you need braces. And when, you know, he of course asked me to bite down, looked at my bite and he saw that this tooth that's jutting out was pressing against that repair and that was what was causing me discomfort. So he actually filed down the repair and it's like a sanding drill, I guess it is. And it caused this tooth to not be the same shape as this one anymore. Um, and there's also some things I want to do cosmetically, like I wanted to do teeth whitening. I tried Crest White Strips, and basically, they're effective, but it was it's a sticker. It's like a really strong sticker. And when I took it off, it felt like it took even more of the amalgam material off of my chip, and that kind of freaked me out a little bit. And then it was really sensitive, so um, this is why I'm getting Invisalign. I'm going to get my teeth straightened. Then, once they're straightened, the dentist is going to redo my repair, making my teeth the same shape again. And then in the process, she said, I can get teeth whitening stuff that can actually go in my trays. I was supposed to go today to get my trays um, placed on my teeth, but they had not arrived. So it was, it's going to be rescheduled. Um, and the dentist that is due, I'm, I went to a different dentist. The dentist that's doing Invisalign is my previous dentist retired. And I just decided to go to one closer to home. The, um, the dentist said that, the new dentist said that Invisalign cannot fix a crossbite as severe as the one I have, and that would take surgery, which is not what I'm going to do. I just want to get these bottom teeth straight, 
this chip fixed and looking right again and teeth whitening. So I have no idea how long it's going to take. I'm guessing anywhere from six months to a year. But I will post again with an update on my Invisalign journey. Thanks for listening. Hope to see you again.